Hey there guys, Reckon here, and welcome to the Side B Brutal Doom Commentary. Now, I'm going to be very brief as since A comes before B, and I'm pretty sure I covered all the basics in the Side A Commentary, I shouldn't have to go over it too much. But just for any of you that are deciding not to watch the Side A Commentary because they're just interested in Brutal Doom, the basics are of doing two separate playthroughs, quote-unquote separate, playthroughs of Doom 2, one, the side A commentary being vanilla with no mods, being, you know, about as vanilla as I can get, but still having a crosshair and mouse control, and the side B being the fully modded, metal as hell, brutal Doom. And with that being the basics, now, let your hair down, throw up your devil horns, get your electric guitars and whatever musical instruments you not, might need, and let's rock. Hopefully the front frame, yeah, the frame dropping is a lot better. As in, it's pretty much non-existent. Okay, it's just gonna have to not mess around with what video codec I just sort of decided recording. All right, so first off, notice there was uh, quite a lot of enemies here. I mean, we're on ultra violence, and there shouldn't have been that many. Also, there's a hallway here. Well, the reason for that is one of the mods I'm using is, I think it's just called, like, the Brutal Doom level. Brutal Doom 1 and 2 level mod. And simply what it does is it expands the levels in Doom 1 and 2 and makes them harder. Example, there is a Kago Demon and Baron of Hell in the nuclear plant or level 2 of Doom 1. There's a Baron and a Tomato Head in the second level. There it is. And there's the Minigun. Actually called the Minigun this time around. I do not like the amount of frame dropping there is, but considering I have to use more programs to record this, because I'm not satisfied with the audio quality that Camtasia gives me. I now have to use a separate program and sync them up. So it's going to be probably some frame dropping. If it gets too severe... Well, probably just re-record the video. So, I don't... I don't know the expansions made onto these levels too well, as I have not played through the entire Doom 2 campaign in the new levels. As far as I know, the further on through the campaign that you go, the less expansions you're really going to see. I don't know if that's from just the mod not being fully completed. Or it's just after a while the expansion has just stopped. And as you noticed, I was able to instantly revive. It was a good thing. Hit this dude in the face. There we go. Oh, there's a Hellhound. Or Hell Knight. He may look unfamiliar. Well, that's because he is a new enemy in Doom 2. He is the weaker brother of the Baron of Hell. With, I believe, I want to say like 75% of the health of the Baron. I don't think it's as low as half. I think 75% is a little bit closer. I don't know the specifics though. I suppose if I had a rocket launcher, I could try measuring his health in rockets. Maybe while I'm doing this, um, version 20 will get released. If it does, that'll be fun. That must be the wrong room.
I hear a hellhound. That's why. Oh, and there's two. Whoa, what the hell? He just stepped on me. I have no armor. The counter's gonna like this. As is Psycho. Okay, they do have a secondary attack. Unlike the Baron of Hell's Wave of Three, they just do kind of a. I can't do the motion, no complain, but they got a, like, one, two, punch kind of attack. So I would like to point out we're literally in goddamn level one, and I've died like ten times already. I'm not, keep, I'm not keeping count, so. If it's way off from that, then that's why. Because I'm not keeping count of what the death count is at the moment. I do that in editing, as you would probably expect. Alright. So, with the Brutal Doom mod, or the Brutal Doom level mod that I have on, it, like I said before, expands the levels and makes them a lot harder. Hence why there was two Keiko Demons and two Hell Knights in this level and why the shotgun guys were lower in this level. Even though there's not a single shotgun guy in the original level. And there's keys. Also weren't any demons in the original level. Even on Nightmare, I'm pretty sure it was just zombie men and imps. So, this is ramped up quite a bit. Also, the doors may look different to you. Well, that's because I'm using an HD, quote-unquote, HD texture pack that I found somewhere. But I think some of the textures don't work. And I think, for some reason, that's also shown off in the side A commentary somehow. So I don't know how that works. Out. Pick up the assault rifle. I got on the side A commentary, this took like four minutes and I got all the secrets. We're at eight minutes and there's still enemies left over. I forgot the chainsaw, didn't I? Yeah, I did. Ouch. Can I go back and get the chainsaw? I don't have my jump bound. That's right. Nah, that's probably better this way. So, there's five more secrets somehow. Actually, I think I know where one of those might be. Now, probably the most obvious thing that you haven't really... That I, that I haven't addressed is the HUD mod that I have. And I forget what's, what the name of it is. If I remember in editing, I'll put it up on screen, maybe on one of the sides or something. Basically what the name is. I'm not going to give you the direct uh, file name. Probably just it's a HUD mod by such and such. Okay, does this still work? I think I heard a door open. Yes. You can use your box of rockets. We're not going to use that right now. Because that'll easily blow us up. Okay, so I'm missing two secrets. I think one of those is in this hallway. Is it here? No, oh, no, I already got that one. I know there's another one around here somewhere. Maybe it's here? 
I, for the life of me, do not remember where that other one is. Ah, well. I might put an annotation or something in editing about where they are, but... Part time was 30 seconds. I don't think we met that. I think we could safely say that we did not meet that part time. Shenanigans. But, either way, I think I'm actually going to do this episode, or each episode's going to be one level, unlike Side A commentary. Even though it'll take a few days before you figure that part out. But either way, I'm reckoning you the viewer. And until next time. I don't know. Just keep keep rocking out, I guess. And don't get punched in the face by a hellhound or something. I don't know. I'm bad at outros. <laughs>